Hey guys, my name's Shady Fierce. Welcome to another video, and today we are reacting to our new puppy from Wolfie Chew. Now, I've had puppies or dogs my whole life. Uh, my grandparents have dogs, and uh, you know I enjoy enjoy I enjoy dogs. I had I had a big dog named Batman. I have two little Yorkies right now named Kona and Lulu, and they're just really cute. But they also poop a lot. <laughs> Luckily, I let them outside and all that. But anyways, hope y'all enjoyed this video. Subscribe, like, and comment to Wolfie Chew and myself. And um, yeah, let's get right into the video. Hi everyone, this is Wolfie Chew. So, As most of you guys already know, I'm a pretty big dog person. I love dogs, and I've pretty much wanted my own pet dog for my whole life. I remember day. when I was little, and I pretty much begged my mom to get me one, but the answer would always be no. She would tell me that one day when I'm older and I have my own house, I can get my own dog. And guess what? what? You know? I'm older, I got a house, so naturally the next move for me is to get a dog. Jordan's pretty much just as big of a dog him. person He's as I am. Older. He's had dogs for pretty much most of his life. But he wasn't quite as eager as me to get a dog immediately after getting our own house. But I kind of started looking around for like puppies for sale bag. nearby anyway. <laughs> Both of us love Japanese Spitzes and Pomeranians, so I was looking well, for a cross in between. Those. And then I found her. I showed Jordan a couple of pictures of this puppy and he really liked her so pretty no, much I contacted the owner and the very next day we went on a two and a half hour road trip out to meet the puppy in person Woo! and of course as Get soon as we it. met Look her we fell cutie. in love. There were lots of other little adorable puppies there but she was the one that came up to us the most and she was climbing on our laps and wagging her tail and I was just like yes we'll she's the it. one. So a week <laughs> later we brought her home. My master plan worked. So yeah, this is Mochi. Mochi as in the Japanese sweet because she's a little sweetie girl and she looks like a little marshmallow plushie. Do We've had her for about three weeks now and I remember when we first brought her home, she was really calm in the car. And I thought that she was going to stay that way, just this little calm puppy that loves to cuddle you. But then she tricked us. As soon as we put her down inside our house, she showed her true self. She crazy. She has got Woo! endless energy. She, she could probably flash. run to China and back and still want to play. Anytime I see her get into her bed and looking like she's finally ready for a nap, I turn around You're and like, she's suddenly in front of oh, me again I'm with so a late. toy in her mouth. But then she'll get tired and climb onto my lap to sleep and I just die from the cuteness. <laughs> So that's my routine nowadays. I play with Mochi until she gets tired, and then I take her into my art room and put her on my lap so she sleeps while I work, until she wakes up and wants to play again. But sometimes she tricks me with this because she's not normally allowed in this room when she's awake. So sometimes when I think that she's fallen asleep and I can take her in there, she actually no, instantly no, no. wakes up I and goes crazy like, yet. yes, it worked, I'm in. She also likes ripping toys open and gutting them by pulling all of the stuffing out. She's I mean, a little every hunter. Dog, man. And anything and everything is her toy. She even goes crazy attacking her bed. Like, don't you want a nice place to sleep? Imagine sleeping on a giant dog bed, though. It'd be so soft. Maybe she doesn't care too much about her bed because she can get comfy in the weirdest places. We discovered that she likes music too. Sometimes we put Yoshi music on for her and she'll fall asleep to <laughs> Yoshi it. Her favorite food is also pretty much anything she can fit into her mouth. She likes eating her foot, my foot, her tail. Luckily we don't have too many cables or things that would be bad for her to eat lying around so we can let her run around no problem. But she's a smart little girl. We've already taught her lots of tricks like sit, shake, high five, and she has mastered the art of puppy oh, dog yeah. eyes. The Although nature. she does have her derpy moments like running into doors, <laughs> randomly falling over, oh, dipping her what? paw into her water bowl for no reason, and then when she runs out over. of water she actually gets mad at her water bowl for not having water in it and she barks at it. She's not very good at catch either. Every now and then she'll randomly just jump like a bunny as well. 
But even though Mochi is tiny, she still likes letting any other animal she meets know that she's yeah. the boss. Like, look at her with her new little sister, Koda. Koda is Jordan's parents' new puppy. She's the exact same breed and almost the same age, but they don't have the same parents. Just look at her. Mochi's crazy. How cute are they together, though? She's also like this with cats, too, by the way. We took her to puppy school for the first mm -hmm. time the other week, and I was expecting her to be the same, just like the top dog. But she was actually really shy. And I thought that we were going to see lots of other tiny little puppies her size as well, but she was actually the oh, smallest by she, far. She, she's Even made some tiny, big huh? boys. Mochi and loves little... being outside, running in the grass, jumping in piles of leaves. It's the purest thing. She's also like me in the way that she will randomly get the hiccups at any time of day. Her hiccups can be intense too. She can even get them in her sleep. I do a lot of stretches and Pilates type workouts at home and one of Mochi's favorite hobbies is jumping on top of me while I do them. Like she's telling <laughs> me I'm not working weight, hard bro. enough. We were warned that when you first get a puppy, you can expect to get hardly any sleep for the first bit because of they will howl and whine all night. But with Mochi, we didn't really get that. I think it's because she goes so crazy all day that by the time it gets to night, she's just really tired and she sleeps through most of the night. So thank you, Mochi. We appreciate that. And here's some more cute videos of Mochi for you guys. Come on, little boss. Hello, you. Hello, little dog. What's up, Mochi? <laughs> Mochi girl. Mochi. That's a cute little dog though, Hello? I'm not gonna lie. Oh. My dogs are like Mochi. my dogs are not like that. Hi. Hi Mochi. Oh. Oh, she actually does have a blue bean bag. That's actually cool. <laughs> No, don't bite her. <laughs> She's falling down the farm. <laughs> Come on. Oh, I'm not doing her in the snow. Oh. Bro, my dogs would not be doing this. Well, I mean, they'd be like riling up in my bed, but like, they don't do anything like that. Hi! Let's see! Woo! Yeah, you're showing off. <laughs> She wants some bubbles. <laughs> oh, she's doing like a philosophy. Smokes off. I know. She's like, I don't need you guys. <laughs> Look at those. <laughs> <laughs> so cute. She's getting like an awkward line where they're like, I know the eyebrows. <laughs> <laughs> she's like, like what? what? <laughs> this is this is cute. This is this is cute. Really cool. Rabbit's <laughs> boy. <laughs> oh, that's cute. Well, now all the dogs are coming in town. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I gave Mochi a Kong and she's scared of it. <laughs> Mochi! Stop barking at it. Go we'll get it. Mochi! <laughs> it's okay, Mochi. It's a toy. Come on, Mochi. It's okay. Get it. Bite it. Do something to it. <laughs> Never oh, she's really not. Somewhere. She's really not going. Get him, Mochi! I disrespected you. It came in your house. Mochi! Hey! Hi! Just go hyper. Mochi! Mochi! Good girl, Mochi! <laughs> Come on, Mochi! Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I, like, I like that pose. Mm -hmm. <laughs> she has the hiccups in her sleep. She's so tired. Take a sense of cleaning your ears for you. Don't worry, I don't throw at this. Just we'll turn her over in about a minute. So They're both so sweet. Not as much as a leaf, but more. Uh oh. Anyway, I love my little Mochi Mo, and I uh, hope that you guys. Oh my god. Alright, guys, y'all can watch the rest of this if you guys really want to. But, anyways, hope y'all enjoyed this video. Subscribe, like, and comment to Wolfie Chew, Sweet Tunes, and myself. Have you guys ever had dogs or any kind of animal in your life? And did you get a new animal, like, this year or anything like that? And if you did, tell me your name and tell me his or her name. Tell me his or her name, and, you know, just. 
tell me a story. I don't, I don't know. Anyways, have a great day, and uh, yeah, goodbye, my fellow reactors. But seriously, why didn't I sound as cool as those guys?